All right, we are pulling up to get ready to turn into the actual community. And I've already gone through it, but I just wanted to kind of give you a sense of the approach and the layout of the common areas and stuff. That's a lift station right there. Um, so you're pulling into this, this road here, this uh, off the main road, and you come around the bend and we're gonna turn a right. So you've got a tennis courts right here, a little uh, rec or community center right there for the um, development. And we're gonna pull in and just go straight back. And I'm just gonna give you a feel of the flow of it and everything. So uh, a couple buildings on the left, a couple buildings on the right. And that right there is the canal that runs straight on out into the Gulf. So you can see it's fairly close to one another. I mean, like not close isn't too tight, but um, it's not spread out too far where you can kind of walk from the unit out to the water and not feel like you're having to trek your cookie so far. Um, the unit, this is the F building right there. Uh, and uh, I believe it was F7. So, right, let me kind of stop. Hey, we got someone who wants to wave. How you doing? Uh, right there where that, right there is the unit that I took the video of. That's your parking, there's storage there. Now, I just talked to another lady. Uh, see where the flag is, see the E? That's number one right there with that storm door. She's going, getting ready to put that on sale, put it up for sale. So I've taken pictures of that unit and I'm gonna send those pictures to you as well. Um, so you'll get a sense of that unit too. She's gonna to be asking probably somewhere around 165. You can tell all the windows except for a couple, like that one on the side, all of her windows have been upgraded for the most part to impact resistant. Uh, that one, I can't get my finger in there shot, but um, the top one there hasn't been, but for the most part, she's done almost every window there in impact resistant. Um, so a lot of upgrades in there, and those pictures that I send will be that E1 unit. So there's the Gulf of Mexico. You can kind of see a little bit. Now, around the bend here is where they have a little rack where you can kind of stock your uh, um, kayaks and whatnot there. So you can walk out right there and drop that canal and shoot out or drag them, I guess. I didn't walk it because the noceums are kicking out right now for the evening and you're getting chewed up pretty well. But they do uh, trim the lower mangroves here. So you can see kind of like a hedge line. So that's part of what the HUA does. They don't mess with these trees here per se, but the actual mangroves that are low, they trim those and that's part of their fees. Um, and they just did that back in March. So that's good that they do that because if they didn't and they let them grow to a certain height, you couldn't trim them anymore. But um, anyway, we'll talk more when I call, but this pretty much wraps up uh, the video here.